I actually remember quite well when I found out that women's boxing was being introduced into the Olympics. As soon as I found that out, I was like, that's it, that's my goal. Later, as I made my first Australian team when I just turned 15, that goal changed and it became, you know, I want to get a medal and now it's, I want to get a gold medal. I've been on the Australian team now for 12, coming on 13 years, and I've learned a lot. The commonality in all of that is that I know my family is always 100% behind me. My parents sacrificed everything to get my brother and I to training and to be able to give us those opportunities when they had nothing. I made the Tokyo Olympics and that was the happiest moment of my life when I qualified for those games. I didn't have my dream performance in the ring. I didn't perform anywhere near what I wanted to. And it was one of the hardest things for me. It was super heartbreaking. And I remember when I finally got home, I realized this is what I need to be around. I need to be around the people that love and support me the most. Now we're on my third Olympic cycle now and it's super exciting. And I feel the self-belief is really there this time. I know that when I come back, you know, I'm still Caitlin Parker. You know, I'm not just Caitlin Parker the boxer. I've got a life and I've got people that love me no matter what. And so that really, leaning on that support network for me really helps me to win well.